Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add weather to your Outlook for Windows email app. So this is the one that comes uh, with Windows that replaced Windows Mail. This is not the Outlook for Microsoft 365 client. So we did do a video on how to add weather to the full Outlook client as well as the Outlook webmail client and also Gmail. So I'll put some links in the description for those as well in case you want to check them out. But this is pretty simple. So to add weather to your Outlook for Windows client, simply go to the settings, go to calendar, then there's a weather section here. Turn this on, pick if you want Fahrenheit or Celsius, and then I have a location in here already. So I'm going to click on save. So now you can see it shows the weather. You could hover over it and you could click on it. It'll kind of give you the highs and lows and the rain. If you click on more details, it'll open up a web page to the MSN weather where you can see additional information. All right, so let's add another location just to see how that works. So back to settings, calendar, weather, add another location. Let's see, find New York City here. So New York, New York, add, save. So now you can see we got New York City here and New York City here as well. And if you click on the arrow here, you could toggle between your locations. And then if you click on edit locations, it'll bring you right back to the settings. So you don't actually have to go to the settings if you don't want. And if you want to remove a location, you just click the trash can next to it. But you can't remove your default location there because that's grayed out, but you could just turn it off if you don't want to see that at all. All right, so to set this up the first time, just go back to the settings here. Calendar, weather, add your location. Pick if you want Fahrenheit or Celsius, and then you could add multiple locations. And if you want to remove them, just come over to the trash can and delete them from there. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.